Good morning, Bulldogs, and welcome to this very special prom day edition of Morning Announcements. I'm Mr. Kearns, and I'm feeling very much alone in here today. All right, I'm going to give you a few announcements here. SGA officers will meet in room 504 on Wednesday, April 22nd. They'll be discussing elections and volunteer hours. Any current officers planning to run for the upcoming election must be in attendance. If you have any questions, please contact Mr. Varnell. AP Environmental Science Review Sessions will be held in room 2303 each Thursday from 2.30 to 3.30. See Ms. Rice for more details. The first session has already been uh, held and a lot of people went, got some good information out of that. The last session will be the Thursday before the exam. Lastly, but uh, quite possibly most importantly, several of our uh, Bulldogs signed and uh, declared for their colleges this week. They were Hassan Clark, he's going to Marshall. Leon Hunter is going to be going to NCANT. And Tiffany Dunham, uh, former broadcaster right here, she's going to be going to Western Carolina University. All of us here at Southeast Raleigh are proud of our Bulldogs and wish them the best in their college careers. All right, for the Bulldog News team, everybody who's going to prom tonight, please, above all else, be safe. If you need to get a ride from someone, call a cab, call a friend. Don't do something stupid tonight. We love you. We want to see you back here on Monday. Have a great weekend. Cecilia Richardson signing in with your K9 News. Baseball is our national pastime. Here at Southeast, you wouldn't know that. Let's go behind the dugout to see what others think. Do I feel like softball gets enough credit for what we do on the field? Um, of course, I wish we got a little more credit. I know if you look at our record, it doesn't reflect how hard our girls are working each and every day at practice. We practice Monday through Friday, except on game days. And these girls are very committed for the most part. And we as coaches are really committed. Um, and we would love to have faculty support, more student support at the game, so these girls feel like what they are doing is really paying off, even though we might not be winning all the games that we wish we could win. We play in an extremely competitive league for softball and baseball. Um, so we're doing a pretty good job hanging with these teams who have played together pretty much their whole lives. So yeah, I definitely wish we got a little more credit. I think softball doesn't get as much credit as other female sports because at their college level, there is no like pro league level like baseball does. I feel as though softball doesn't get much credit because for one, we don't have that many supporters. And also people think softball isn't competitive like all the other female sports. I don't think softball is as popular as other sports because people don't really view it as a really competitive sport. You have basketball, volleyball, and track. Those are really competitive. But I think that people don't really think softball is really competitive. I can honestly say that softball is a boring sport because I don't know nothing about it. But baseball is a fun sport because I played on the Wii. You feel like baseball and softball are underrated? This is Sylvia Richardson signing out with your K9 News.